wouldn't be able to have this pageant here at Almsey, which I hope you've enjoyed. So I'd like to say thank you to the Confederate Tribes of Siletz Indians, Chief Seattle Club, Confederate Tribes of Grand Ron, Nara, Klamath Tribes, Northwest Native Chamber, Wafed Bank, who actually was here doing a volunteer team. Thank you, Wafed Bank, which is my bank. <laughs> bank with them, go open an account today. <laughs> Kiana's Creations, who made the beautiful tumblers. Thank you, Kiana, for making the tumblers. I have a lot of fun designing them, and I asked her if she would like to sponsor those beautiful tumblers for all of our contestants, and I was so happy when she agreed, so thank you for those. Naya Family Center, Pendleton, Coral, Stor Coral Story Beauty, Resting Warrior Face, SLS Native Couture, Nichiwana by Lulu Henry, HM Arte, Hojo Herbal Creations, Nite Clothing, and we also want to say thank you to Augustana Lutheran Church, who served as our fiscal sponsor and has been really guiding and mentoring me as we um, navigate the process of becoming a 501c3 ourselves. So at this time, I would like to, yes, thank you. At this time, we would like to call on Pastor Mark because we have something for you that we would like to gift you with. Pastor Mark. So my mom has been working on this really, really meaningful and beautiful um, piece of art that she would like to give to Pastor Mark. And you know, not a lot of people know this, and actually I didn't until I learned this year, but Pastor Mark was raised by some really amazing parents who I remember thinking one day, you know, how did Pastor Mark get his start at being a leader? And then that next Sunday in service, he talked about it. And I thought that was so neat because I was just thinking that to myself, but God has ways of answering when you have questions. He had really amazing parents who encouraged him to not only honor and respect the native people of this land, but to honor those friendships and to always work with our native people in peace and harmony and to be able to be that leader that restores those past traumas and to heal and move forward. So I want to say thank you, Pastor Mark, for always being there for me and my family and for mentoring us and, you know, just really also having patience with me. <laughs> You're a really great leader and just thank you so much. So my mother made this beautiful beaded cross that we would like to honor you with. You know, the gift of the human family is such a gift. And we live in a world that needs to hear that every single day. Our diversity of all of our backgrounds is just a gift, and our children are all gifts. So I'm honored and humbled to be here. I'm just a servant, trying to help weave the love of community. Thank you so much. And I, I have to say, too, uh, knowing some of the leaders here today uh, and knowing leaders who, who taught me, um, and the Reverend of the Rank and, and the Solar Rank and others, I've always thought the best weavers of community are Indian. There's a spirit of community that keeps weaving. So I've learned so much. So I'm humbled and honored, but thank you so much. Rebecca, the best is yet to come. Get ready. What did you all think of the talent presentations? <laughs> so there's a few categories that the Miss Indian Northwest pageant consists of, and that starts with the personal essay that the ladies turn in. The second part is the introduction slash personal interviews, which they had this morning, and then the traditional talent presentations, and then tomorrow <laughs> evening, at 7 p.m., we will be doing Grand Entry at the Delta Park Pow Wow. It's free and open to the general public. We were gonna have the last part of the competition, which will be the dance competition, and this is gonna be a chance for these young women to express themselves through dance. That necessarily doesn't have to be Pow Wow style. We're just giving them the floor to a Pow Wow style song and looking for them to 
really show us who they are as young Native women leaders. And with that, thank you for attending the traditional palette presentation. Young Gold Leaders, take it away.